Hi, I'm going to show you how to build your first form. When it's finished, it will look like this. Let's get started. When you log into your DoForms account, this is the first screen you'll see. From here, simply click on Build Forms. On the left side of the screen, you'll find the form building components. The gray area is where you will place each of the components into your form. On the right is where you configure each component in your form. To get started, click on the New button or click Open to work on a form you've already started. Let's start by adding a label and naming it New Employee Form. Now let's add a text box so we can add the employee name. Let's drag up a date function to capture the employee's date of hire. Now let's capture the employee's gender. We can do this by using the Choose One function and setting the answers to male and female. To capture the number of dependents, we'll use the numeric function. Now let's get a little more sophisticated by creating an employee survey using the questionnaire function. Start by adding a caption and then click on the Append Comment box so you can add a comment to each question in your survey. To add survey questions, you can use the Choose One function, the Select Multiple function, or the Score function. For this example, we're going to use the Select Multiple function, setting the answer to Yes and the caption to the question you wish to ask. Then, you simply use the duplicate button to create additional questions, changing the caption for each question. Adding pictures to your form is easy. Simply use the image function and use the caption to give your picture a name. Next, you want the employee to sign the form, so click on the signature function. You can use a hint to add any legal disclaimer that might be required. You can automatically send the form as a PDF using the email function. All you need to do is capture the email address. Remember, you can use a hint in most of the functions to provide additional instructions on how to answer questions. Once your form is complete, add an action button, give the button a title, and then choose the Save and Send action. To get a sense of what your form will look like and how it will function on a mobile device, click Preview. You can enter data in the preview. So go ahead and try out your form. Once you're happy with your form, hit the Publish button, give your form a name, and click Save. And then pat yourself on the back. You've built your first form. For videos on more advanced topics, check out our website at www.doforms.com.